Hello, welcome to Trivia Night Live on Buzz TV. I'm Brandon Tomasello. Finally, finally, I got my friend Quentin Burke from Dos Catas St. Augustine to join us here today. How you doing? Great and yourself, Brandon. Thanks for having me. I'm doing really good, and I want you to tell the audience where you're from. I am originally from South Africa, the Deep South, uh, born and raised for 18 years in South Africa, moved to London, and finally found myself here. About how long ago did you get here? Uh, roughly nine years ago. Nine years ago, good. I've known you since about that time too. Uh, you were at Dos Gatos downtown, am I correct? Yes, we originally opened up the first Dos Gatos in 2009. Okay, and then when did the Dos Gatos St. Augustine uh, location open? We opened up Dos Gatos St. Augustine 2014, Christmas Eve. 2014, all right, that's great. Uh, and can you tell everybody about what Dos Gatos is and about the location itself? Basically, we have two locations, uh, one, town downtown, one downtown Jacksonville and one in St. Augustine. Um, we, I like to describe it as scratch cocktails. We make a cocktail from the ground up. I joke with our customers that we have more fresh produce than Publix has. Mm -hmm. uh, fresh kiwi, mango, papaya, banana, strawberries, raspberries, the list goes on. And so basically what we do is we balance a cocktail out to your liking and we make it from scratch to your liking. Now, I've always said going to Dos Gatos was when I was young, this feels like going into a lounge. It is a lounge experience. Like when I was young, I was like, oh, what's that great mysterious looking place? Dos Gatos, San Augustine and Dos Gatos downtown seem to create that atmosphere. Uh, and one of my favorite cocktails over there is the orange jalapeno margarita. You still make that over there? Yes, that's been on our menu religiously for nine years that's now. That's just absolutely delicious. I'm putting you on a spot here, but what would be one of your favorites on your menu right now? Um, I'm a whiskey guy, a uh, big fan of Woodford Reserve. So we have a cocktail called the Wall Street Old Fashioned. Oh, that's right, yes, yes. And uh, it's basically an old fashioned, twisted a little bit with some drambuie and walnut bitters. Walnut bitters, that's the thing I remember mm -hmm. the most about that. That's great. Well, uh, we all want to play uh, fact or fake with you right now. Um, if you win, I'm going to give, well, actually, whether you win or not, I'm going to give you like 10 tickets to our next upcoming Oktoberfest that we're going to have in November, I think. Nice. Uh, so, I'll go first and I'll ask you this question. You tell me whether it's fact or fake. Um, Leonard Skinner was named for a gym teacher at a Florida high school the band attended. Fake. It is fact. <laughs> I got one of them. Your turn. <laughs> Everybody in Tahiti gets free internet from Bill Gates because he lost a bet. That's fake. That's crap. <laughs> okay, fake. we got one then. All right. Uh, my next one is, in 2008, Snoop Dogg started work on a bluegrass album. Fact. That is fact. Nice job. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Bluegrass. I'm a big Snoop Dogg fan. Uh, George H.W. Bush once had a cameo on Saturday Night Live in which he critiqued Dana Carvey's impression of him. That's fact. That is fact. Whew, I think I remember that. No, I I'm too young to remember that. All right. Uh, and then finally, uh, let's see. Mini golf was invented after a hurricane wiped out half of Pebble Beach. Fact. That is fake. What? I'm a golfer too. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you have one more? Um, it's gonna be an easy one for you. In the comics, Superman died once, but got better and returned to fighting crime. That is fact. That is fact. Whew. All right, we did, that was fun. All right, good, so let me ask you this. Any events that you want to promote over at the Dos Gatos St. Augustine? Well, every Wednesday during the week, we have um, Blackjack on the Rocks comes down. Mm -hmm. um, shot starts promptly at 9 p.m. Mm -hmm. um, basically, you come up to the bartender, you buy a drink. The bartender will reimburse you for Blackjack money, and then you walk up to the table and you try and win some drinks at the table. That's great. Is it free? It is free. That's great. And it's free to play for everybody. On Wednesday nights? Wednesday nights at 9 p.m. Uh, and then, if I understand correctly, so we're doing Oktoberfest uh, here at uh, Client Focus Media and Buzz TV in November-ish, I believe, um, or excuse me, in October. But uh, you have something coming up in November, is that right? October 22nd is um, November 22nd. Sorry, you okay. were correct. Um, Night, Nights of Lights. Basically, the whole town lights up with lights. It's a big tourist attraction where everybody comes down and rides the trolleys, bar hops, and just enjoys one of the biggest spectacles of St. Augustine. That's fantastic. I will be there myself. Well, I want to thank you guys for being joining us here at Buzz TV with Trivia Night Live. Thank you again, Quentin, for joining us, and we'll see you again.